Today, a new 30,000 square foot library opens in Newton. KSN's Mally Jones is live with a first look inside, and it all looks amazing behind you. Good morning, Mally. Yeah, hey guys, good morning. Well, I am here inside with all of the books, the audio books, the printers, the computers, you name it. They got it here inside. And this has been a decade in the making, the library director tells me. And I have her here with me this morning. Carrie, you were telling me earlier about so many different features that this library has that the, that the old library did not. Can you tell me a little bit about those? Of course, so we have a new drive through service window and book drop which is fantastic we have a patio seating area with an outdoor fireplace we have a bunch of new study rooms for individuals or small groups to work we have a highly expanded new teen area with computers and a switch and our children's area is much improved as well including a fantastic new program room for story time and all those kinds of things awesome lots of new stuff to look forward to in the community will get their first chance to see this library in person inside coming up this morning at 10 o'clock and coming up here in just 30 minutes. I'm going to be taking you back to the children's area. It's super cool. So stay tuned for that. Eddie, Alexis. All right, Mally, we'll see you back here in the next 30 minutes. Thank you. Happening this morning, the new public library in Newton opens. Mally Jones is live inside with a sneak peek. Good morning, Mally. Good morning. Well, I am here inside one of the coolest new areas in this place. This here is the children's library, and I want to start off by showing you just these windows. Look how cool they are. They're shiny, they're colorful, super inviting into this children's library here. And then moving back toward these computers, these have educational games on them. You've got a walrus, you've got a fox and a hat and a scarf. And then we've got some board games over here that you can check out. Also a travel activity kit also so if you're headed out on a road trip anytime soon, then your kids will be plenty occupied if you check out those travel activity kits there. And moving here to the play area, we've got a kitchen, we've got blocks, we've got all sorts of toys here in this area. And this project has been a long time in the making. I have the library director here with me this morning, Carrie Cusick. Carrie, can you tell us why you guys felt like this was beneficial for the community? Of course. So. Our old library served the community really well for, for more than 50 years, but there were accessibility challenges, infrastructure challenges. Uh, we just needed a place to support modern services. Uh, I think what we've gained the most though, as you say, we have a lot of information, we have a lot of resources, great things for people to do, but this is a place where people are just gonna wanna be. You know, whether it's whether it's playing, working in a study room, going to a program, just grabbing a cup of coffee in front of the fireplace, it's a place we can welcome everybody in the community and just encourage people to, to just hang out and connect to one another. Super exciting, definitely a lot to do for all ages. And we're gonna show you some more areas of the library coming up here in just 30 minutes. A new way that you can check out books without even getting out of your car. Eddie, Alexis. Looks super cool. You gave us a full walk and talk. I can't, I can't believe there's more to show us, so I can't wait till 6.30, Mally. Thank you. Today, a new 30,000 square foot library opens in Newton. KSN's Mally Jones is live with a look inside. Mally, I'm excited to see what you're going to show us now. <laughs> Hey guys, well, yeah, you, you may have thought, Mally, did you go to a fast food restaurant? No, I am still here at the library. This, believe it or not, is one of the new features here at the library. So you can come and check out a book without ever leaving your car. So I've got uh, unicorns and goblins here. I've got unicorns of many hats as well. So very great literature here that you can just come and grab without ever getting out of your car. And also down here to my right, there is a new 24 hour book drop so you can come and drop off your books as well without ever getting out of your car in this 30,000 square foot facility, $10 million project has been a big community effort. And I have the library director here with me. She's gonna come in the window here. And Carrie, can you talk a little bit about how this is impacting the kids and the families here in this community? Yeah, so, you know, as a library, we want to give people the resources that they need to make their lives better, whether that's entertainment, education, personal growth, 
Um, so it's going to impact families for generations to come. And this is a great example, like a drive through just removing as many barriers as possible so everybody can, can use the space to the fullest. So we're excited about that and ready to welcome everybody today. Yes, that'll be awesome. And today at 10 a.m., that is going to be the first opportunity for people to come and check out the library. That's when the ribbon cutting is. So the community is invited to that. You can come on inside and get your books, get your games, check out anything you need, use the drive through window if you want, so it's going to be a lot of fun. Eddie, Alexis. Mally, can you see if you can bring back some Harry Potter books for us? <laughs> I'll see what I can do. <laughs> Thank you, Mally.